Darkness falls across the land. The midnight hour is close at hand. Creatures crawl in search of blood to terrorize your neighborhood. Welcome, everybody, to the Gameru Let's Play of Dead Space 1. Now, this is a classic, maybe? I think it's been 10 years old. I don't know if it's considered a classic yet, but it's, it's a great... Uh, sci-fi survivor horror and I f really enjoyed this series before EA fucked it up with Dead Space 3 and just ruined the entire franchise but uh, it's still great it's it's um, I mean as in Dead Space 1 and 2 I never played 3 but I've just heard so many complaints but we're gonna go ahead and start a new game here for the for for October, I, I love getting in the mood of Halloween. And yes, that means us playing mostly survivor horror video games. But uh, to be honest, I love survivor horror video games more than I do horror movies. Horror movies are great, but there's like very few that I really enjoy watching. And very few that I can watch a second time. Uh, horror movies don't really scare me too much. A few jump scares here and there kind of get me, but very few have that... Um, uh, you know, uh, the, the, same, the same stuff you can find in uh, horror video games or, or uh, that full immersion. I can't really get that in movies. Isaac, it's me. Here we go. It's part of, to you. Here's a story. Storyline cinematic. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I wish I could just put on the phone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. Hmm. I believe this is Nicole, Strange. Isaac's wife. Such a little thing. How many All times right. you watch that thing? Guess you really miss her. Don't worry, we're almost there. How about You'll none of your business, bitch? Sounds like you do have a lot of catching up to do. Maybe. Hey, we're here, sinking our orbit now. All this trouble over that chunk of rock. All right. Deep space mining is a lucrative business, Ms. Daniels. Yeah. Each is Planet cracking. Gold mine, according to prospectors reports. Cobalt, silicon, osmium. Now, where is she? There she is. We have visual contact. Yay, the Ishimura. So that's the Ishimura. <laughs> Impressive. The USG Ishimura. Biggest planet cracker in her class. And it looks like they already popped the cork. Why is it all dark? I don't see any running lights. Corporal, take us in closer and hail them. And stay clear of that debris field. We're here to fix their ship. All right. I don't know if any of you have seen uh, Dead USG Space. The, the um, maintenance team of the USG hmm, Kelgen what is it? It's, it's, the, it's an animated in, uh, movie. Uh, it's supposed to be the prequel of this. And it shows, it uh, goes a little more detail how the Ishimura the uh, got affected by this, I don't know, Morphing, mind controlling, spire. And uh, and and basically, you realize it, basically these these guys get the signal, the distress signal from Ishimura by the one of the security guards that was in the prequel. It wasn't too bad. Uh, I wasn't a big fan of the animation, but it's not a bad uh, not a bad animated movie. Not sure if they made another one. I have to double check that. Automatic docking procedures ago. Oh shit! What's happening? Sir, the auto dock. What is it? We're off track. We're gonna hit the hole. Hit the blast shields. That guidance tether is damaged. Switch to manual now. Inside the magnetic field? Are you insane? Oh yeah, man. Isaac's kind of calm in this. And they should take a damn seat. He's just like looking around, like, oh, that's cool. Oh god. Oh god. Oh lord. Is We're fine. Okay? We're safe. What? What the hell were you thinking? Were you trying to get us killed? I just saved our asses, Miss Daniels. If we had aborted at that speed and distance, we'd have smashed right into the side of the Ishimura. Now settle down. Let's get to work. Oh Over damn. Report. 
I'm not getting any readings from the port booster, and we've lost comms and autopilot. It'll take some time to All fix. Alright, let's get some extra hands from Flight Deck to help out. Our hair's freaking out. Hold still, Isaac. I'm syncing up everyone's rig with the ship. Okay, we're done. Clean bill of health for everyone. Alright. Alright. We've still got a job to do. We're moving out. The character face mods is a little, uh... They didn't age too well. Uh... Man, it's hard to believe this game came out ten years ago. I remember when it first came out. And then, uh... When I finally got it, uh, I was very amazed by it because at the time, there wasn't too many survival horror games. Uh, the survival horror games that were big at the time, I think Resident Evil 5 was out, but that's when they started making that transition from um, survival to survival horror to more action. You, power to the port booster. you lost the port booster. Unbelievable. Oh lord, she's pissed. Anyways. Oh, oh, look at physics. Look at these awesome physics. We're gonna see some of this awesome physics with the with the ragdoll bodies in this game in a bit. But anyways, um, if I recall, yeah, that Resident Evil 5 had a, a transition. That was a big transition. It was more action-y than horror. And I, I enjoyed the game. It was okay. It wasn't my favorite Resident Evil, but I did enjoy it. People bitched about the AI with, uh, what was her name? Ah, I forgot Chris's partner's name, but people uh, bitched about her um, AI I, for some odd reason. My the AI for in my game, she was okay. wasn't terrible. She never got me killed or anything, not that I recall. But um, yeah, Resident Evil Five was like play play once or twice. Not you know not a not a not a big. Game, of course, Resident Evil 4 is amazing, but if I had to say, Resident Evil 1 Remake is my all-time favorite Resident Evil game. But anywho, like look at these guys. With their weird Should ARs. That's the future guns look like, people. Yeah. Well, there's not. There's nobody here. I can't pick up any broadcasts. Can't pick up shit. Can I say this game? Nope, stand by. Isaac, log in and see what you can find. Yeah, can I, can I save? Okay, cool, cool, cool. I can't. She's tall. <laughs> He's so pissed. They're both pissed. She is tall. Or is Isaac pretty short? Or he's just hunched over. I think he's, he's just not standing straight. Okay. Okay, cool. Alright, that's my... Where do I go to laser? Oh, now I can save. Alright, let's save it. Yay! Wow, that was fast. <laughs> I remember two best friends. They played um, uh, Dead Space 2, and they noticed what you know he had it on. They're playing on PC like I am, and and going to the save menu was just ridiculously fast. Huh? That doesn't look good. She's taking a lot of damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The tram system's offline. Getting around is gonna be difficult. Look at that. The air seems to be flung again. That's a start. Uh oh, what's there going on? Let's see if it. What the hell was that? I was playing a test run last night, and the character model is kind of freaking out. Let's see if it does it again. What was that? Not sure. The hell? I don't know. Something's in the room with us. Behind you, fool! Didn't hear that. Are you serious? Okay, that was better than uh, yes, uh, yesterday. <laughs> I'm getting the hell out of there. Run! Fuck you guys. Oh shit. Oh shit. Run fool run. Get in that elevator. Ha ha. Can't get me. <laughs> he just fucks off. Oh lord. That's awesome. Oh man. Love that. Oh, he left his head and his little arm here. It, uh, Dead, Dead Space is. What I, what I did like about Dead Space is it has a lot of. Uh, uh, it does take inspiration from movies. Oh, look at this. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yep, reload. That was weird. I, I remember in Dead Space 2, it's X. Hold, hold, hold aim and X, now it's hold aim and A. There's somebody getting their ass kicked. Yeah, but I'm not gonna go there yet. Okay, whatever. Let me open this shit. Okay, here we go. But anyways, Dead Space takes a lot of inspiration from movies as, uh, The Thing, which is amazing. If any of you, if any of you haven't seen that one, check it out. Hold on, let's, let's get this guy real quick. Ugh. There we go. Now let's shoot. Uh-oh. What the? There we go. Oh. Oh. Where's the... Did I get... Oh, there it is. Physics is freaking out. But anywho. Let's see what this guy was gnawing on. Oh, this poor soul. He was alive? Damn. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> That's the kind of face I want to have when I die. I let me reload. Anywho, um, so yeah, they, they take a lot of inspiration. Uh, this game takes a lot of inspiration from uh, uh, the thing, which is like I said, amazing. If you haven't if you haven't played it, it's I'm oh, sorry, seen it. It's really good. And and they made a video game off of it, which is like the uh, I believe it's like the uh, sequel to the movie in a way. And at the time was not a bad game. Now it hasn't really aged well. Uh, that that game could use a serious remake, like a really good serious remake, because uh, I think they could really um, do some cool stuff with it. Uh, I've never played it. Uh, I've seen two best friends play a little bit of it. It was pretty funny. I've seen the ending on YouTube. Uh oh. But it's not a. It, from what I hear, it wasn't a bad game when it came out. Uh oh. I can't believe you made it. Isaac. Anyways, watch the movie The Thing. Ran to more of them on the very first one. Are you okay? More what? The 1981. What the hell are those things? Is that the crew? Oh my god. Voice down. Whatever they are, they're not friendly. And half the doors on this ship are locked. Yeah, no the shit, they're not friendly. They're zombies. Zom zombie, alien, monster, the parasite thing. I don't know what the hell call them. I don't know what to classify them. You're crazy, Hammond. You're gonna get us all killed. If you listen to me, I will get you out of here alive. Now what's wrong with the tram? Uh-oh. It's offline, of the course. The data board is right, but there should be a spare in the maintenance bay. There's also a broken tram blocking the tunnel that needs to be repaired. Damn it! Everything is on the other side of this quarantine. We can't reach it from here. No, we can't. But you can. Isaac, if I can get to the bridge, I should be able to access the personnel files. You fix the tram, and I'll help you find Nicole. Cool. Nicole's dead, probably. Spoiler alert. Alright, okay, oh, 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 here we go. Lock us, get some more ammo, health. I forgot to use health, I forgot how to use health in this game, but I'll figure out later. But anywho, uh, it also takes inspiration, this, this game also takes inspiration uh, from Event Horizon, Paul W.S. Anderson's Event Horizon. Uh, if you don't know who Paul W. S. Anderson, he's a guy who directed Mortal Kombat and the Resident Evil movies. Or the very first Mortal Kombat movie. Uh, I don't know if he directed the second one. <laughs> that, that's that's a fun one to watch uh, with some friends after a, a night of eating and drinking. Trust me, I haven't done that but yet, but I plan to soon. Anyway, uh, I know this guy. Alright, he did. And there was another glitch I was playing through last night. He was just there, like, you know, still alive and the music was still going on. So I kept shooting at him and this body just disappeared. So I guess I guess the game just needed a little bit of a uh, computer reset. I'm oh, sorry, computer restart. Oh, another save. Yes, why not? Why, this, oh, man, so convenient, these saves. All right, let's get this. Uh, but, yeah, uh, Paul W.S. Anderson directed... Um, Event Horizon, which is not a bit. I say it's his best work. Alright, so there's our lore on why we should cut the limbs. Uh, which is kind of neat, like, you know, most horror games, um, you know, at the time, and this this was, he of course, heavily inspired by Resident Evil 4 with the gameplay. Um, uh, basically, um, uh oh. Oh, yeah, that's supposed to scare me, I guess. Uh, man. Isaac is extremely powerful. <laughs> or the suit gives him a little bit of a strength enhance enhancement. Isaac, be careful. 
shooting them in the body didn't seem to work. Go for the I, I, yeah, I got that like that once from the tutorial, once from that uh, audio log, and then three times he's like, hit him in the limbs. I remind you like three times. Anyways, um, Event Horizon is is not bad of a of a movie. I saw it with some friends uh, a while ago, uh, a few years ago, and it's it's not bad. They, they were laughing at some of the parts and. And yeah, it, it's kind of an old, uh, that's a 90s horror movie, late 90s horror movie, but I, I really enjoyed the movie. Looks like that door is malfunctioning, Isaac. Okay, I forgot how to do it. Try using the stasis module you just picked up. What's X? Alright, yay. Uh, but yeah, I consider that his best work, Event Horizon, which is, which is really cool. Uh, if, if, you, if you're wondering who comes out, I think the actors... I know Sam Neill's uh, one of the main characters. If you don't know Sam, I think it's Sam Neill. That's the guy from um, uh, Jurassic Park. It's like Dr. Allen. I think that was his name. Oh, and I like this because it's supposed to scare you. What's this say? Pawns. You hear like these noises. But look what happens after a while. Lights come back on. Isn't that neat? Oh, what's in the restroom? Is this the ladies or men's? Oh, it's a both, but let me see. You know what? Fuck it, I'm gonna go to the ladies' restroom. Let's see. Nothing in here. There's a lot of ammo in here. A lot of ammo on normal. Any monsters? Nope. Just health and ammo. Alright, let's see. Wee. Oh, I can't go through here. So I know where to go. Oh, we already, you know what? Why not save because I got all this ammo. That's one thing. If if unlike the very first Resident Evils where you had your uh, ink ribbons, uh, which I thought was cool. You know, you had a limited time. You had a limited amount of saves, and and when when they're here free, you know, doesn't waste anything. Why not? Just 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 save. Just, just make saves galore. Take advantage of it. Take advantage of the situation. Okay. I know there's a fight here, but I'm gonna do it. This module should be able to help you with that arm mechanism. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Let's see what's gonna happen. Alright. Okay, those guys are fine. They're not gonna turn into necromorphs. Double check. Alright, never mind. Uh oh. Here we go. Oh shit! Not that one. All right. Did he drop? No, no ammo. Anything? Nothing. Wow. Okay. Oh, a power node. Are there any more? Okay. I know if I activate something. Activate this puppy. Aha! Alright, nothing. Alright. Ha! Any more? And every time you activate something, something pops out. So I always gotta double check my entrances, exits. Best thing in Survivor Horrors, um, both in like original RE, Silent Hill. Uh, RE4, heck, RE5, I guess. Uh, and, um, did I do it right? Oh, shit. Oh, that's right, that's right, that's right. I gotta use my stasis, gotta use my stasis. Okay, here we go. There we go. Now I can activate it. Uh, what? There we go. Now I can activate it. Okay, what? Any any monsters? Okay. Isaac, you did it. All right, cool. The tram is blocking the whole system. Oh shit. When you get the computer online, right, you'll be able to call the tram from the control room. Faster the better. 
I can hear something crawling around out there. All right, thanks for the warning. Haha, I knew it. Ah, I keep doing that for reload. This is gonna really get annoying after a while. Okay, whatever. Keep pressing X to reload, but it's to shoot your stasis. Oh. Look at that. Put him down here, boy. What if I can, like... You know what? I could aim. Aw. Oh. That's cool. I guess I don't engage the enemy yet. It's been a while since I played Dead Space 1. And I finished it back in, I want to say, summer. I know it was like summer of... Because I got it in 2009. And I finished it in like summer 2011, maybe. And I, I, I will play halfway through it. And then I take a year break for some odd reason. And then come back to it. Uh, but, but I did play Dead Space 2 a bit. And I played that one recently, a, a little while ago. It's in here. Oh, no. Oh, wait. Okay, gotta go back. But some some, some fans would consider Dead Space... Dead Space 1 to be a lot scarier than 2. I don't know. I, I think they're about the same when it came to scare-wise. I think maybe they say Dead Space 1 is scary because that was the first one they played. Oh, here we go. Uh-oh. Alright, I remember this time. Oh, sometimes they come from behind. There we go. Cool. And nope. No ammo. No ammo. How much ammo do I have? Oh, something popped up. Uh, 30... 30 rounds, and my inventory is full, and I'm just wasting so much. Oh, so much health. What to do with all this health? Actually, I get rid of this. Restores. Uh, select. Drop. And we'll get health. I need a bigger inventory. Isaac, I've patched into the deck security system. It took some work, but I've got the door to the maintenance bay unlocked. The data board should be somewhere inside. Alright. Oh, I gotta go there. Alright, no, oh, is that the elevator? Yeah, it's the elevator, I think. Alright, automatic cargo truck. Oh. oh, might as well save again. Yes, yeah, save. Alright. Gotta love PCs. Save super fast. Oh, oh. All right, let's go in here. Isaac, it's Kendra. It looks like the door to the storage room is locked. There should be a key somewhere in the maintenance bay. Well, that's cool. He goes in that teacup hold, teacup grip when he is uh, moving. Uh oh. Uh oh. There's one. I say it's the doorway. Another guy. There he is. Nothing there. Here we go. Oh, I can use that thing, but I rather really throw it at somebody. Okay. Nah. All right, six rounds. Oh, 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 oh. Any other monsters? I know they like to sneak up on you. Gotta get a better visual. Alright. Aha! I'll just use this guy. Ah, I missed it! Ugh. Oh, I did it! That blast rate sucks! And I just wasted rounds just trying to get that. Oh, shit. Eh. Eh. What am I doing? Ugh. I'm sucking at this aiming. You know what? The sensitivity is really rough on this. Hold on a minute.
Well, there's no way to make the controllers, the control stick, uh, easier on me. So in other words, I have to. Oh, where? Aha! I knew it. They always. They always like they sneak up behind you. There's another one. Yeah, they always do that. Oh. They always love to sneak up on you. 